Well, the main reason I'm passionate is, is leadership is such an impactful thing. It makes such a difference to so many people's lives and positive difference to the organization you work in. And most people just find themselves in leadership positions and hence really struggle. It takes a lot of energy when you're struggling to find your way. And so the reason I really love this program, it really helps people step into leadership to get clear about how they need to be as a leader and equips them with some very practical tools so that they can lead others in, in a positive way that makes a difference to those people, grows them and help them be better and deliver results as well. So it, it's, so that's what I love about it. The aspects of the, 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 tra the, the training covers, um, delegation, setting expectations, coaching. It looks a little bit about uh, managing stress and resilience, not just in yourself, but when you're managing a team, how to make sure that they can be resilient in the workplace. Um, we're also, also looking a little bit around the neuroscience of leadership. So how, how do you need to wire yourself so that you can be a, a great leader? We, we spend time looking at what your values are and how that comes across so you can be an authentic leader. Um, those are the key concepts that come to mind. Okay. So the, the program is really experiential and what, um, what people will be doing is to bring real life challenges into into the, the program so how can they apply some of the theory and concepts to their real world problems in their real life context rather than it being a theoretical models and the other thing to say is is what in terms of what people can expect uh, expect is um what we might call a bit of a coaching approach so rather than telling people how they should be leading how they should be uh, facing their leadership challenges to really elicit from them what their own solutions are and to build the capacity also for them to provide more of a coaching approach in the way that they are leading and managing others. So for me, it's a couple of things. It's one is the kind of the cocktail of the, if I can describe it like that, of the content. So we cover the bits of content that really serve you as a leader so that you can really hit the ground running and make a difference. So for example, we can, we're going to help you think about how you can delegate or effectively, um, how you manage expectations, how you can coach others, both for their development, but also for their performance, how you want to kind of make your values, authentic values come through as a leader. So we, we, we've created a cocktail of content that is most relevant. That's the first thing. The second thing is, is, is that um, the environment you're in and the way we set that environment up means that this learning community really supports you through your learning, as do your tutors. And then finally for me, because, you know, there's one thing learning about leadership and another thing about making pragmatic, we work really hard to help you make this work for you in your context and your environment. Yeah, so um, I think a range of, of challenges. So in terms of the content that Charles has, has covered, um, one of the challenges that, uh, major challenges that people kind of stepping into this leadership position can face is, how do I uh, choose how I work with delegation? You know, how do I manage that, that challenge of feeling accountable for what is produced, but also leverage my team effectively? And that's one of the, the core challenges that, that we know that new leaders face. Um, challenges around how do I work sustainably to really deliver quality and impact and being able to do that in a, in a way that that's possible to be sustained over the long term and um, a kind of avoiding burnout. Other challenges I would say are around how do I really lead others to get the best out of them? So uh, how do I take a bit of a strengths-based approach? and developing um, more of a kind of coaching, mentoring mentality, rather than seeking to provide all of the answers from, uh, from my own expertise. So on the program, we'll be asking people to bring their real life current challenges. So you get the opportunity actually to get uh, in the moment, feedback, support and challenge about how you can work differently with this challenge, which is immediately applicable. We have a big focus 
on the programme of kind of grounding and an action planning to take insights forward into action, uh, which is which is uh, really supportive of actually applying things back into the real world. The other thing that um, that we that we do on our programmes is to offer people the opportunity to buddy up as partners. So they may wish, although we don't offer formal coaching, post-program coaching for, for this programme, we what we know is that after three days there will have been some important relationships and networks that have been found that we will encourage people to uh, keep working with so that they can support each other to, to sustain their insights and learnings after the programme. Thank you.